Hello everybody, it's Diane Zayn, some Jack Boy here bringing you guys a very special pre-sequel video. Today I'm going to be showing you guys that you can get special loyalty bonus rewards right when you start up the pre-sequel um, if you have Borderlands 1 and 2 save data present. Um, you get two uniques, as you can see on the screen, this is one of them, the Bull Pup. Um, the red text reads, One Bad Pup. <laughs> um, and then the other unique you get is a Masher type revolver called the Smasher, uh, the red text reads, seven times the fun. Now along with these beast weapons, you also get uh, free badass rank points, because if you guys don't know, badass rank has returned in the pre-sequel. Um, you get that right off the bat, and you also get right off the bat uh, 30 free moonstones um, if you have Borderlands 1 and 2 save data present. So this is really, really nice um, You know, to start out the game, to start your journey. The, these rewards are really, really nice. Now going over these weapons for you guys real fast, just kind of a quick review and what I think uh, when it comes down to how how well these guns perform in combat. So uh, starting off with the bullpup, I, I really like this gun. Um, I, I like the the magazine size. It's, it's really big. I, I think that's actually part of the special effect. Um, and it's just it's really good overall, you know, starting weapon. I really like both of these weapons in general. They're just really good. For starting out the game, I noticed they're a lot better, in my opinion, than the uh, golden gearbox weapons on Borderlands 2 that you uh, started out with um, if you if you pre-purchase the game or you got like the DLC pack or whatever that allows you to start with them. Um, you know these are a lot better. Um, so and it, you know all you have to do is actually have Borderlands 1 and 2 save data, and, and in order to actually get these things, you don't have to pre -order, you didn't have to pre-order the game or anything. You don't have to wait for a DLC to come out if you didn't pre-order the game. You can just get these right off the bat if you have Borderlands 1 and 2 save data present, which is really, really cool. Now, what I think of the Smasher, or Masher, you just have to remove the S, and it's called the Masher, since it is kind of a Masher-type weapon. I think that's what they're referencing here. Um, I really hope there is Masher-type weapons in the pre-sequel other than this thing. That would be amazing. But, yeah, I really, really like this. Um, it's, it's definitely good for starting out, just like the other gun. You know, they're, they're both really good. A lot better than the gearbox uh, golden weapons, but my only complaint about this thing is how fast it chews through its ammo. Um, it, it consumes like six ammo per shot, and that's really a big issue. So you're constantly reloading, but it still does quite a bit of damage, and it can get you pretty far, pretty quickly. Alrighty, guys. Well, that's just gonna about wrap this up. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm loving the pre-sequel so far. It's a lot of fun. You know, obviously doing videos on it is is really kind of different for me since. Uh, I'm not used to doing videos on like new games that just barely like came out. So you know I'm I'm, I'm gonna get used to it, um, just kind of over time. But it, wow, this video is is just is mind blowing to do. I'm not even kidding you guys. It's it's a lot of fun to do. I'm I'm really looking forward to uh, doing more pre sequel videos for you guys. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this, and I'm out of here. Peace.